does the spirit at work in you belong to god or to satan do you want to identify it does the spirit at work in you belong to god or to satan do you want to identify it does the spirit at work in you belong to god or to satan do you want to identify it welcome all of you in the mighty name of jesus to this video let us see what the topic is today does the spirit at work in you belong to god or to satan do you want to identify it then you see this whole video and understand whether you are belonged to god or you are belonged to satan okay first thing is you must worship true living god of the world that is jesus christ there is no any other god except jesus christ except jesus christ whatever you worship whatever idol you worship whoever you worship you are worshiping the satan and your spirit if you worship jesus christ as your god true living god of the world your spirit is belonged to god if you worship any other thing except jesus christ whatever you worship the idol gods human beings idols or whatever may be if you worship any other thing except jesus christ your spirit is your spirit is belonged to the satan your spirit is belonged to satan when you worship any other thing any other idols any other human beings of this world except jesus christ the second thing is that if you spoil destroy or defame the name of god that is jesus christ purposely your spirit the spirit which is working in you is not belonged to god but the spirit which you carry that is belonged to the satan the people from different religions they will not believe jesus christ and they will spoil the name of jesus christ telling some other unwanted things related to his birth his family etc these people who defame spoil destroy the name and personality of jesus christ the spirits which are working in them are not belonged to god but they are the spirits which are working in them are belonged to satan from different religions people will come and spoil the name of jesus destroy the name of jesus purposely these people the spirits which are working in these people are belonged to satan only because satan is the enemy of god satan doesn't want to appreciate or praise or recognize god true living god of the world jesus christ as god of the world satan doesn't want to recognize jesus christ as god of the world because satan is the enemy of god satan is working against god satan is fighting with the god in the world that is why so if your spirit which is working in you 
forces or an inspires you to dis, uh, destroy spoil defame the name of jesus christ in the world you understand that the satan is working in you the spirit of satan is working in you understand it it is not the spirit of god spirit of god will not do such type of work spoil the name of others or true god of the world that is the spirit of the satan if you disrespect your parents father mother brothers and sisters the relatives the neighbors friends people who are in the society you understand that the spirit which is working in you is not belonged to god but the spirit which is working in you is belonged to the satan to satan understand it if your spirit belo is belonged to god you will not disrespect your parents brothers sisters relatives friends people in the society because of the spirit which is belonged to satan that is working in you you are disrespecting all these people in the society and in the world if the spirit of god is working in you you will respect your parents father mother brothers sisters relatives friends and the people who are living in the society you will respect them you will love them you will not hate them you cannot hate them you will love all the people you will respect them treat them in in a gentle way if you do not do these things towards other people of the society you understand that satan is working in you, in you. the spirit of the satan is working in you next point is you should not murder you should not kill or harm or attack others in the world you should not kill any people of this world you should not harm them you should not disturb them you should not attack them you should should not speak ill of others if you do all these things in your life in the world you understand that the spirit which is working in you he is not belonged to god but belonged to the satan satan spirit is working in you if the satan spirit is working in you you will do what terrorism all the terrorist activities you will do in the world against other people against the people of different religions you will kill them attack them murder them and you will harm them persecute them all these activities you will do in the world if the spirit of satan is working in you next thing is if the spirit of god is working in you you will not involve in adultery you will keep relationship with your wife only if the spirit of the satan if the spirit of satan is working in you you will be you will involve in adultery in the world you will go with all the women and you will enjoy as far as possible physical pleasures will be your motto and aim goal of your life because the spirit of satan is working in you if the spirit of satan is working in you what and all you will do you will cheat others you will rob others you will steal things and money of others you you will long things of others you will deceive other people 
steal the things of others, money of others, cheat the people and get the wealth of others. All these illegal immoral activities you will do in the world when the spirit of Satan is working in you. When the spirit of God is working in you, you will not involve in these activities. You will be perfect, gentle, decent, follow truth and justice in your life. You will not steal the things of others. You will not desire the things and money of others. If the spirit which is working in you is of God, you will not say lies. You will speak truth only. You will not talk, talk against others. You will not speak ill of others. You will not give false witness about others. You will behave decently, gently, justly, in a truthful way. If the spirit of Satan is working in you, you will do all these things. You will speak ill of others. You will talk against others. You will try to destroy the fame and personality of others. Because evil spirit is working in you. Spirit of the Satan is spirit of Satan is working in you, that is why. Another thing is if the spirit of God is there in you, working in you, you will not covet things of others. You will not covet money of others. You will not covet the wealth of others. When the spirit of Satan is working in you, you will desire things of others. You will covet money of others. You will covet wealth of others. All these, all these comes, all these things come out of greediness which is given by Satan, not from God. Finally, if the spirit of Satan is at work in you, you will involve in all the terrorist activities such as Killing, beheading, cut off the heads, cut off the hands, cut off the legs of others, threatening others, murdering others, bomb and kill people, kill the people of the society or of other community or other religion. Like these activities you will involve. If the spirit of Satan is at work in you. You will involve all, all these terrorist activities in the world. Because Satan's spirit is working in you. If God's spirit is working in you, you will not involve such type of terrorist activities in the world. You cannot kill others. You cannot behead others. You cannot cut off the hands and legs of others. You cannot harm others. All these activities come from the spirit of the Satan. Understand it. If the spirit of God is at work, in you, you will have these qualities in you. What are the qualities? Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness and self-control. All these good qualities will be there in you, in your personality if the Spirit of God is at work in you. 
what are the qualities of spirit of god see love joy peace patience kindness goodness faithfulness gentleness and self control these are the fruits of holy spirit of god such a type of person cannot kill others cannot harm others cannot be hurt others cannot cut off the hands and legs of others cannot bomb and kill the people of the society of any other community or any other religion when the spirit of satan is work, working in you you will do all these terrorist activities in the society in the community now you can identify what spirit is at work in you now what spirit whether it is spirit of god or whether it is spirit of the satan you can identify now subscribe share like